All right, so this is a Gilchrist Model 17 guitar that was actually owned by David Grisman, famous mandolinist and multi-instrumentalist. Uh, I'm actually going to uh, just show this guitar just for the heck of it. Uh, well, actually, we'll just do that. Okay, so there's the headstock, and then we come down. And like most of these guitars, it's been taken very, very good care of. All right, and uh, I'm certainly not a gypsy guitar player, but it has this. So anyway, so here's the front of the guitar, and uh, it's got some uh, nice uh, spruce. I don't know if it's at or on deck or not. And then we come down to the finger board, and once again, we kind of showed you this, but there's your headstock. Turn it over. I don't want to knock anything else over in the room. And let me move my uh, camera here. Or my computer. There we go. Okay. And then you can see the detail in the wood. El Widow. There we go. Yeah, Gilchrist uh, really takes us to an extreme. Uh, this is just cutaway, nice cutaway, guitar. Whoa, okay, so over there we see the sides. Uh, closer up at the inlay is not that you need this, but uh, why not? Might, might as well just go crazy here. And there's the the wood on the neck. Um, there's the back. It does have a Barte, Bartolini, ah, Bartolini, Bartolini pickup, you can see. There's that. And the whole look of the guitar there. This is done for famed guitarist Rick Taylor, who plays many kinds of music. Incredible personality he has. His personality is unmatched. Even with this guitar, you would not succeed in having the personality of Rick Taylor. Gypsy music. The only thing missing is Rick Taylor's sweet vocal voice and his naturally curly hair, which gets even more curly in the morning when he doesn't dry it. I don't even think he washes it. But anyway, so, but, uh, but you put Rick Taylor with this guitar and you have the ultimate of 
personality and tone. for the guitar and that's the tailpiece we didn't do a close-up of that but you get the the gist so that's it <laughs>